Well, good morning, y'all. A little kind of a rough night's sleep. Um, fog came in, as you can see, and uh, I got three or four hours. And I spilled my coffee cu cup this morning, luckily before I had coffee in it. So I wasn't able to get coffee. Today I'm looking at a, I think a seven or eight mile hike. This morning's about a mile uphill to Spring Mountain, but then we finally get on the AT. So yeah, rough going for the first day, but I'm optimistic. It's gonna get better, right? And I'm gonna get in better shape every day, one step at a time. I'm gonna continue down the, down the trail. Got some rocks here. I haven't even made a spring mountain yet. I know this is nothing, but just want to show you, it's not always smooth trails. And yes, I'm still huffing and puffing. Be a few days of that, guys. Hang in there, just like me, it'll get better. Hey y'all, so just to make it official, I am on Springer Mountain, which is the Southern Terminus. And over here, I'm gonna walk over and show you the plaque. Sorry, you don't have the greatest of views over here. But uh, make sure I don't bust my booty on the way over here. But you have, it, you have it in your phone, I can't quite remember the name. It's at Neil's Gap. Here is the iconic plaque and just so you see my first step on the Appalachian Trail here we go and I am officially on and I was following blue blazes yesterday tomorrow I will follow the white blazes from here on out see you down the trail So you know guys, I made down from Springer Mountain and uh, Miss Janet's in the parking lot. I don't know if she's gonna trail magic or not, but I'm gonna go say hi to Miss Janet. So we'll walk up there and say hi. There's her van right over there. So say hi to her. Oh, I think it's first trail magic. <laughs> so we're coming down to the parking lot. Miss Janet's here. My first uh, day on the AT. And uh, when I talk about trail magic, we've got bananas and we've got all the food here for the hikers and drinks. And uh, I think these guys appreciate it too because they all have partaken in the trail magic that's out here. So. Not a bad first day. 
second real day, but first day on the actual AT. And yes, there's Miss Janet. Uh, Hi, Miss Janet. Hi, darling. <laughs> Well, hey y'all, I'm back on trail after uh, getting a few items to eat from Miss uh, Miss Janet and uh, starting my climb out of the parking lot. But she is awesome. She's uh, taking gear for other people and shipping it forward for them if they've overpacked. And uh, I mean, just what a what a beautiful woman, you know. That's a beautiful soul there. So. Thank you, Miss Janet. It is very appreciated. You know, I want you to know the hikers out here really appreciate what you do. Well okay, guys, so we're coming up to my first actual uh, stream crossing. So we'll film it, that way if I fall, y'all will get a good chuckle. Don't want to fall, but we'll see. Ooh, the rocks are a little slickery, if that's a word. It is now. Well, yeah, y'all, I told you yesterday, I like bridges, and guess what? Get to go across another one. These aren't the most spectacular bridges. Looks a little sketchy, but let's walk across with me. See what we think. It's actually not too bad. All right, I'm heading that way up the trail. Well, it's daytime and I don't see anybody here. Maybe one person here at lunch. I think this is the uh, Stover Creek Shelter. So I'm gonna stop up here, have lunch, refuel, and continue. This is a very narrow little bridge here. But you know what? We're gonna go over it. Ooh, okay. Interesting little bridge. Ah, perfect. And back to the trail. So if any of you are wondering why this one's got a double blaze on it, a double blaze means there is a intersection or a turn coming up. Most of the time there'll be a blaze like this and the top one will be tilted if it's left, then you go left, if it's right, you go right. 
This one just marks an intersection, I believe. It's okay, little guy. Hey, y'all. So I, I took a blue blaze. Um, this is over at Long Creek Falls. So I guess I'll live it over here. I want y'all to see this in person. I understand why this is worth coming to. I mean, come on, guys. So, also in this section, they do a lot of our military training. So, kind of scary to come through the woods and see these up here. They're probably out there somewhere doing training. I can really see the view through there, but fog's definitely cleared on the top of Hot Mountain. So I'm guessing about a mile to go to get to Hot Mountain Shelter where I'm gonna spend the night. So right before I get there, I'll uh, come back and wrap up for the day. See you in a little bit. Well, hey guys, I'm in my tent at the campground, ready to go to sleep for the night. There's all my stuff there. It's time until p.m. I might take that in a bit and go nighty night because I did a little, uh, little over nine miles today. Um, so, beautiful day, as you saw. But 
I'm tired. So I'm going to go to bed and I'll see you guys or I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good night and happy trails.